what is the first thing that you do when a problem comes your way? What some people do is think about it so much on and on and on and on. It gets to the point where it messes up your whole day. You can't really think about anything else, only about your problems. And you get really down. You may even stay in the home, stay in the house, and perhaps sleep or cry all day long. You may not even eat. You may even take out your anger on other people that don't deserve it. Don't you know that you can be happy while you are going through bad issues? You don't have to let the problems that you are going through to take over and make you feel as you do now. It is possible to be happy while going through problems. It truly is. What do you mean, Kevin? How can I do it? Okay. The way that you can do it Listen, aren't there some good things that are happening in your life? Of course there is. Because of God's grace, there are good things that are happening to us all. Even the people who choose not to serve him, even the people who are in sin, God allows good things to happen to those people. So you can't say that good things are not happening to you because that is a lie if you say that they are not. You are just noticing or taking note of the bad things that are happening to you other than the good things that are happening to you. So there are good things that are happening to you, okay? Even though you are going through problems, yes, there are good things that are happening to you, okay? So what you can do other than focusing on the negative, what you should do is focus on the positive things that are going on. Focus on things that you can do for other people. Focus on other things that you plan on doing. You don't have to think about your issues all day, every day. My Lord, what is the point in thinking about bad things all day, every day? Are your problems going to be solved if you contemplate on the negativity all day, every day? Of course not. You are just hurting yourself. Let me say this. Back when I was in sin, I used to contemplate on my problems so much. And I found out that when I thought about my problems every day, all day, I started to feel worse. So what I learned and what I told myself, this was when I was in sin now. This is when I was in sin. When I was knowingly and willfully choosing to disobey God, I learned that Focusing on my problems made me feel worse, so let me not think about it until I have to deal with it again. Even while I was in sin, doing that helped. Yes, I was not really happy, 
because I was in sin, but I was less unhappy. <laughs> if that makes any sense. <laughs> I was less unhappy. <laughs> And then when I gave my life to God, hey, things became much more easy. Now, let me say this. Something happened a while ago, maybe two, three, four, I don't know. Let's say five to six years ago, something happened. And my mind was on, man, this is really going to make sense here. Something happened about six years ago, I believe. And it was running through my mind every single day, my Lord. And I was tormented by it. My Lord, I was tormented by it for, because this event happened and I learned that I had to go to it. So it was about one or two weeks until I had to go to it. Man, for two weeks or one week straight, the thought of it tormented me for about two weeks or one week. My Lord, I thought about it every single day. And, my Lord, I could not really think about anything else. I could not have fun doing the usual things that I wanted to do. I was in great fear. My Lord. I was contemplating on it every single day and I could not really eat. I was depressed. It was horrible. It was horrible. I was mentally tormented for about one or two weeks because I could not and chose not to stop thinking about those problems. Like I was so anxious. It was horrible. It was really, really horrible. When you choose to not stop thinking about something, about something bad, you are going to be really, really anxious. You are going to be really depressed. Fear is going to set in, man. When fear sets in, much more bad things are going to happen to you. Even though bad things are happening to you, you can choose to think about other things. You don't have to contemplate on the bad issue every day. Look, I have been going through something ever since 2016. So it has been over a year, I believe. Yes, over a year that I have been going through something. Imagine if I thought about this issue every single day. Man, that would drive me nuts if I thought about it every single day. Now, at first, I thought about it because of other people, but it is my fault because even though people are pressuring me to think about it, I still have a choice to not think about it. But it was really, really, really bad. 
you can choose to think about the good things that are happening to you, not about the bad things. When you are this way, I am telling you, you are going to be much more at peace. This is how you have peace, not contemplating on your problems. If you stop contemplating on your problems, you are going to be much more happy. I am trying to tell you. Think about it. Myself, other people who choose to serve God and choose to do the right thing, we all have issues going on in our lives. If someone comes to you and say that they don't have any issues, they are lying. They are lying. How in the world can you be in a cursed world and say that you don't have any issues? That is a lie. By you lying about something as silly as that, that tells me that you have even more problems. <laughs> because there is no... Listen, if someone is going to lie about something really small... I don't know if you know anyone that lies about petty, silly things. If you find a person like that, that shows you that they have much more problems than the average person. I don't have any problems. What? Are you serious? <laughs> that shows me that you are a huge liar. Because if you will lie about tiny small things you are going to lie about large things so if you are my lord if you are willing to lie about dumb things that tells me how your character is i can't trust you i can't trust you if you are willing to lie about dumb small things my lord so I pray that this makes sense. You can choose to think about positive things. You don't have to think about negativity. Because if I did, I would not be able to make YouTube videos. I would be too down, too depressed, too sad too mad, too angry, too irritated to do anything or to do it properly for God. So think about that. No matter what is going on with you in life, you can choose to just don't think about your problems. Think about God and the positive things that are happening to you in your life. God bless you.